Hello, I'm David Payne, world famous scuba diver, and I'm going to show you how to find a frogfish. Let's begin, shall we? Step number one Know what a frogfish looks like. First, you need to know what you're looking for. A frogfish is a weird looking little critter that doesn't move too much and tends to blend in with everything. It's been described as a stomach with fins. They can be as small as a thumb or grow as large as your hand. They also have little marks around their eyes. If you look closely, sometimes you can see a small growth on their head which is used as a lure to catch other fish. They truly are masters of camouflage. So why do people want to find them? Because they're so hard to find. You figure it out. Step number two, know where to look. These fish can blend in well with reefs and come in a variety of colors. In order to find the prize, it helps to know exactly where to look. Frogfish can frequently be found living on or near sponges. There are a lot of varieties of sponges. This gives them a lot of colors to choose from when they hide themselves. So if you find a reef with plenty of sponges, then begin your search there. Did you see the frogfish? I've already shown you one, so you can see just how hard they are to spot. Step number three, don't look for the frogfish. Now that you know what to look for and where to look for it, just relax and dive. While in Bonaire, my friends and I went to one of the best dive sites for finding eagle rays. It was there, while focusing our attention on finding eagle rays, that my friend was distracted by a little bit of movement, which turned out to be a frogfish. And here it is. Kind of cute, isn't it? See the little foot-like fins? Marvel at how well it blends into its surroundings. And the spots around the eyes. If you look really closely, you can even see the small lure on his forehead. Now let's review the steps to see how you can find one. Step 1. Know what to look for. Step 2. Know where to look for it. Step 3. Don't look for the frogfish. Go back to step one and pretend not to look for it by following step two but ignoring step one. What I, what I mean is don't consciously look for what you're looking for at a good place to find it because it's easier to... Oh, just go to step four. Step four. Have your friend find a frogfish and show it to you. If you follow these steps just the way I showed you, I guarantee you will find a frogfish every time. Take it from me. I'm David Payne, world famous scuba diver. Thanks for watching.